What's up, Libras? Welcome to Ocean's Tarot Garden. How are you guys growing and how are you guys glowing? All right, today we're just going to do a simple reading, just seeing exactly what you guys can expect for this upcoming week for you guys. This is for all Libra placements, specifically sun and moon is what I'm hearing, but take it as it resonates. Whatever it doesn't resonate with you, leave it behind. All right, so we're going to go ahead and see what you guys can expect this week coming up my Libras what can Libras expect this week coming up mm. okay that's a good card to pull out off the top we got prosperity lays ahead or well, lies ahead okay with the new moon in Taurus yeah okay so I feel like a lot of you guys been in some kind of void with finances and things like that uh some financial challenges or there could have just be like I'm not gonna say like everybody's struggling, but the, I'm gonna get a sense of like things could have just kind of stopped for you guys here financially. Like um, maybe sales start slowing down, or you you know you didn't have as much money coming in. You could have been trying to you know increase your finances, but maybe it was just little trickles here every now and then but nothing just really really significant for you guys is what i'm feeling here we also have that a personal issue is going to reach resolution so there could be a very serious conversation that's coming in for you guys i see this blue which is making me think of the heart chakra the heart the throat chakra here you guys i'm talking faster than i mean my mind is going fast and my words can't get out as fast as the thoughts that's coming in for me all right, so I do see we have full moon and cancer here. So you guys could be having a heart-to-heart -heart moment with somebody. This could be a loved one, okay? Whether it's platonic or romantical, it doesn't matter. There is something that's being expressed here. Some of you guys could be either having someone cry to you about their finances or you could be crying about your finances. I do feel like there's a conversation based around finances. I do also feel like there is a conversation about a new journey here. So this could be romantical. This could be career. I feel like you guys are going to be feeling some kind of inspiration to jump into something new. I feel like a realization is coming in as well. I feel like with these these dark moons here, it just gives me like voided energy. So I feel like you guys are finding spaces, you're finding things to fill those spaces, but I feel like it's healthy things here for you, Libra. So I do feel like healthy habits are coming in. I do feel like a lot of clarity is coming in. I do feel like a lot of releasing has taken place. All right, so it's just giving me like, um, an empty chalkboard is time for you guys to design an empty just an empty space for you guys to start recreating whatever it is that you want i also want you guys to know that i'm feeling heavy heavy energy of that there is power in your words libra so it's time for you guys to start speaking 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 whatever it is that you want be careful of what you're speaking be careful of the intentions that you have behind your words and the energy behind your words okay so let's see what we have here for look at that we have the magician and strength. Yeah, so you guys are really creating some shit. All right. Definitely in your strong uh, manifestation bag. I would like to say Libra is definitely in that bag. That bag, that bag, that bag, that bag. Too many cards. Can I get just a few cards for you, bro? Okay. With this prosperity lies ahead, we have the high priestess. So somebody here could be carrying a child in the womb here. For you guys, I do see somebody could be pregnant by a Taurus, a Taurus person, um, either Taurus male, Taurus female, doesn't matter here. Um, I'm also feeling like you guys are going to be carrying, for some reason, I'm getting like a stubborn little boy, okay? He wants everything his way, temper tantrums, all that great stuff. It's like the terrible twos energy I feel in here. Uh, so yeah, I also feel like you guys... Look at this. I don't know why, but I'm hearing that you guys are going to be sitting in luxury here. I'm loving that for you guys. I'm hearing sitting in luxury, but planning accordingly. So make sure that you plan what you're going to do with your prosperity. Peace, love, and money is what's coming in for my Libras as well. All right, so we do have the Nine of Wands underneath the personal issue reaches resolution here. So you have the Nine of Wands. Okay, so I'm feeling like Aries and Leos here. Okay, so you guys could be feeling, like I said, a conversation. 
Um, I just feel like you guys are going to be reaching that, like, you know, you guys are kind of, I don't want to say that you guys are soft-spoken, but some of you guys are kind of more reserved. And, you know, you try to understand things or you don't really like to speak before thinking about what you're speaking. I feel like you guys are finally going to be kind of outspoken. I feel like the power from your throat chakra, you're going to like express some feelings here that other people may be uncomfortable about as well. You could be having a conversation with somebody who has fire heavy in their chart. You could be having a conversation with an Aries, like I said, or a Leo here um, to be coming in. This could be um, based around the child here and maybe the financial conversation of support and different things like that. Most of them, like, somebody wants to talk about emotional support as well. Somebody sees you as an emotional support, and they could be needing a conversation with you to try to, try to get clarity or see your side of things or see, you know, how you, your perspective of things that's going on here. So, yeah, you can expect that this um, upcoming week, okay? Let's see. This new start coming. You have the Nine of Pentacles. So yeah, it looks like money is starting to flow in with you guys. You guys are getting a little bit more independence with your finances. So I feel like you guys are going to be able to do a little bit more than what you have been able to do. Increase in business here. I feel like the struggle with finances and stuff are starting to kind of resolve itself here with this high priestess, this nine of wands and the nine of pentacles. Yeah. I'm going to grab my book right now because something is telling me $2.99 is... An angel number that I need to look up for you guys. So let's see. It says, thrive, evolve your thinking. You are given the go ahead to embrace new ways of thinking. Your angels remind you that evolving your thoughts, ideas, and value ideas and values is a sign of personal growth. Journal about how a view you had in the past has changed drastically over time. Okay. So like I said, this conversation is releasing, you're recreating everything. I just have like a a the chalkboard has been erased, has been cleaned, and it's time for you guys to recreate here, okay? So I do see that you guys are going to be feeling yourselves a lot lately, okay? It's just like, you guys are, you can't sit with me, you don't want to sit with them, okay? You're sitting in luxury, you're feeling valuable, you're feeling confident, you're feeling whatever this word abrasive means, because it's coming to me, but I have no idea what it means, okay? So I just feel like you guys are really owning some kind of independence, stability, um, the way that you view yourself. It's just like love, okay? You're, you're glowing, you're feeling good here, all right? I'm hearing that in nine months, somebody's going to be having a baby. And <laughs> so that's that, that womb energy that I was feeling there for you guys, all right? A lot of you guys could be having a lot of dreams as well. You need to start acting on those dreams. Okay, Libra. What else do we have for my Libras? What else do we have for my Libras to close this out? While you're here, July is coming to a close. So please make sure you check out Enlightenment Lotus, the um, website down below. Comment your favorite angel number down in the comments for a chance to win next week on our community tab i will be posting the winner i am wearing the turquoise stretch crystal ring right now so make sure you do that this is we got one more month to go where we're giving away goodies here all right so make sure you check out and support and if this message is resonating with you any little bit i know it's quick but if it seems to tickle your intuition go ahead and like comment and subscribe all right can i get one more well, two more ones to come out. All right, so we have confession. Someone wants to tell you something coming ahead. So we do know that conversations are about to happen. Somebody's going to be confessing their love, confessing um, the fact that they kind of miss you. Some of you guys could be kind of mysterious. Somebody feels like you kind of like not as present as you have been so i do hear that with that vacation i feel like maybe you've distanced yourself i do feel like some of you guys need to go and take a vacation take a trip if you haven't already um also a date night seems to be very important here some of you guys can't really get out of the town but i'm feeling like maybe you know going to a nice restaurant out in the city and get a room for a night type of thing all right somebody is missing some kind of connection somebody's feeling lonely here somebody is feeling um I guess like they feel like they're being overlooked or unheard here. We do have a liar here as well. So 
beware there's somebody around you who is lying in the conversation uh, I feel like somebody's gonna be saying they're gonna do something for you or they have something for you and it's just lies I also feel like there is somebody has Pinocchio syndrome here okay I feel like somebody's trying to hide something from you either they're trying to hide the money that they owe you or they're trying to hide another person like a significant other here Okay, so be mindful of that. And at the end, you have, yes, ladybugs. Luck is on your side. So yes, like I did, like I said, I feel like a lot of great things are coming in for you guys, especially when it comes in for prosperity and love. Um, love, money. <sighs> yeah. I want to say like everything is just attracting to you. Everything is falling on you. Blessings on blessings on blessings. Energy by Big Crit is what's playing in my mind. I just feel like high vibrations. You guys feeling very, very, um, finally feeling inclusive and some kind of abundance here. I do feel like maybe somebody is going to surprise you with a, a trip. Somebody's been lying about doing something because they've been trying to plan something for you as well. Okay, like they're trying to sneak to surprise you. So that's what I have for you today, Libra. I hope you enjoyed your reading.